Hey, welcome to another episode of Eagle Public Library Unboxed. So today we have two boxes. Let's uh, go ahead and open them, see what there is. I've kind of partially opened these already, so they're not quite as quite as difficult. So the first one we've got, uh, here's a, a Zane Gray book. Uh, Riders of the Purple Sage and the Rainbow Trail. And what's this? Karen Kingsbury, Love Story, a Baxter, part of the Baxter Family series. Patterned After Death by Elizabeth Casey. French Fried by Kylie Logan, looks like a mystery. And A Touch of Frost by Joe Goodman. And so that's the first box, kind of a little one. I'll scoot those up. And we'll come down to this box, finish opening this. Get rid of the packing material. Oh, this looks like a looks like a bunch of kids' books. And get that cut open. All right, so in this box we have, oh, 51 things to make with paper plates. That's kind of neat. What's this? A bunny. You could make a bunny or you could make a necklace, bug hats, a peacock. Hmm. Scoot that up. And then uh, yoga for children, animal somethings, asanas or something. I don't know what that is. And Kennedy and King, the president, the pastor, and the battle over civil rights. Uh, here's um, Magpie Murders by Anthony Horowitz. Firebrand. Uh, by A.J. Hartley, The Prisoner in His Palace, about Saddam Hussein. Here's a kid's book, The Lucky, Unlucky Lottery Winners of Classroom 13. Mercedes Lackey, uh, Study and Sable, a little paperback. The Owl Always Hunts at Midnight, a novel by Samuel Bjork. Here's something called The Possible, a novel. And, oh, I just saw an ad for this yesterday. Stitched, the first day of the rest of her life. I think this is a, a kid's um, graphic novel. Barkus. Edge of Extinction, codename Flood. Looks maybe like a fantasy, science fiction-y kind of book. And lastly, Kingdom of Olives and Ash. Writers confront the occupation of what? The occupation of something. Maybe Israel or something. Yep, Israel and the West Bank. All right, so that's it for this time. Um, come back next time and you'll see something else. See you then.